This week will be an apparent test of Jackie Trad in Queensland. Now, I was a bit poo-poo about this story on Thursday, suggesting that uh, there is apparently going to be discussions inside the Labor Party about what to do with the unpopular Treasurer. Now, she's very popular with the left. She's incredibly important to the numbers inside the Parliament. But clearly, in a 50-50 election, she is a drag on Palaszczuk's ticket. Now, Labor seems to generally do a better job than other parties because of their central control of being saying that, well, you, the minister, you, the backbencher, have become the story. It's the team that always matters more. Please get out of the way. Tomorrow, apparently, there will be a meeting of uh, the entire Queensland government, the Labor MPs, where apparently people will be able to stand up and in front of the Treasurer, in front of their factional bosses, apparently they're going to be able to say whatever they want about Jackie Trad. Does anyone think this will actually happen? I get a feeling that a meeting will happen tomorrow and they will say, nothing to see here. Which is great news for those of us who think that the government needs to get flushed at the upcoming election. Her job is to take care of the finances. The Auditor General showed that they are spending at a faster rate than they are bringing money in. They've hired tens of thousands more public servants than the state needs. And pork barrelling projects where if Jackie Trad had done this week what she did last year, buying a house where one of those pork barrelling projects is going to take place, she would have broken the law. But because the drawbridge has come up after what she did, which has now been ruled illegal by the parliament, guess what? She keeps jogging on. Wait, watch and see. Queensland, you have your say a little later in the year.